More private renters on low incomes struggling to afford their rent. More families living with the threat of eviction. Growing waiting lists for social housing. A rising housing benefit bill. Stigma and prejudice. Increased homelessness. The decline in social housing over four decades has led to many of the housing issues we see today. From 1945 to 1980, we built an average of 125,000 new social homes a year, under both major parties. Last year, there were only 6,500 new social homes. We're in the middle of a national housing emergency. We cannot go on like this. Without a radically different approach, we face a future in which a generation of young families will be trapped renting privately. Up to one third of 60 year olds will be renting privately by 2040. Billions more will be paid to private landlords in welfare costs. Hundreds of thousands more people will be forced into homelessness by insecure tenancies and sky high housing costs. We are calling for a decisive and generational shift in housing policy based on a new vision for social housing. A vision for a vastly improved sector with proper regulation where tenants have a voice and good quality homes built in the right places. And one which offers more people the security of a social home. Many more. Social homes for 3.1 million more households over 20 years. Enabling us to meet the new challenges of our modern economy and our ageing society. So that the benefits of a social home can be felt more widely and that it can be both security for those in need and also a step up for young families trying to get on and save for their future. So that there can be hope for those in greatest need, such as people who are homeless and disabled people. So that there are opportunities for young families otherwise locked out of ownership and security for those reaching retirement and looking at the prospect of older age in insecure, unaffordable, unsuitable private rentals. We believe this vision is the only way the government can meet its 300,000 target for new homes each year. It will provide an affordable, stable home for 3.1 million households. It will save £60 billion in benefit costs over 30 years. It will command huge public support. Join us and help make it a reality.